Hi and welcome back to Cut the Craggle. Late last night, about 1am before I went to bed, I noticed that there were some new 2022 LEGO Marvel sets revealed on LEGO.com. So of course, I jumped straight on my laptop and recorded a new news update video to go through them with you all. Like heck I did, I went to sleep. But I'm awake now and I'm ready to check these things out and give you my thoughts. Hey, I might not be quick, but I'm honest. First up, we have this Iron Man mech armor, and yeah, we've had one of these before, but this one is a bit different. Mainly, this has a lot more gold going on. It feels like a remake to me. It definitely has a few new features. It's got this weird shield thing, and it has the new stud shooter, which I'm still not sure about. The biggest draw for me though would be the new Iron Man figure and it's interesting to see that they've used a gold base for the torso and legs. But one thing I have to say, what is up with that face print? Well not face print, the helmet print, but it's kind of like a face because it has an expression on it. Just look at that and tell me that you don't instantly think of the grumpy cat meme. I mean come on Iron Man, why so sad? Anyway, there's a couple of mechs, one of which is Black Panther. And do you know what? I think this might be my favourite. It's not particularly interesting. In fact, it looks a bit skinny. And why exactly does Black Panther have a mech? I don't know. But I like the minifigure. I like that we got a T'Challa face print. We did kind of get one. Or we did get one in the minifigure series when we had T'Challa as Star-Lord. But it's great to get one of him as Black Panther. The torso print looks awesome. I think that's a new one. I think I might pick this one up. The most surprising one, though, is the Wolverine mech armor. It's been a long, long time since we had any Wolverine or X-Men minifigures or sets. I think the last one was a Mighty Micro set. But yeah, we have a new Wolverine set coming in 2022. January 1st, 2022, these sets are released. I would say that I think this is going to tie in to the upcoming X-Men 97. There's basically a revival of the old 90s cartoon X-Men series happening on Disney+. And this definitely has that cartoony comic book feel to him. But if you look at the box art, it doesn't have the X-Men 97 logo. It just says Wolverine. I'm excited that we're getting another Wolverine set, even if I think this one is garbage. Why does Wolverine need a mech? He's indestructible. Even from the box art, I have issues with this. How exactly is he controlling this mech? Because you can see his arms poking out the sides. Is he controlling this with some other appendage? Am I... Am I supposed to conduct with my penis? Those are the three mech armor sets. They're going for $8.99 each, or they will do. There's another LEGO Marvel 22 set that's been revealed. And oh my gosh, is this one hideous. What on earth were they thinking? It is an Iron Man figure. That's what it's called. It doesn't even have the word buildable in the title. The official title is Iron Man figure. Wow. And look at it. What is that? Is this meant to be a UCS set? Because it has like the plaque, right? But it doesn't have a minifigure to go with it. And it's only $34.99. I don't know what this set is. It's bizarre. This is a hard pass from me. In terms of the free mech armor sets, I don't know. I, I like them and they are pretty cheap, but the main draw for me is the minifigures. And living here in the UK, what tends to happen is the minifigures in these armor mech sets become freebies with the LEGO Avengers magazine which I get. Let me know what you think of these new LEGO Marvel 2022 sets in the comments down below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on notifications, all that jazz, and I will see you next time. Laters!